guys welcome back to the channel and welcome to another video if you're watching this the day that it goes up happy new year's eve if you're watching it later happy new year i have to say before starting this video i really feel like 2023 has been the fastest feeling year of my entire life i'm really hoping 2024 feels a little bit slower i don't know have you felt the same way have you taken down your Christmas decor yet? Mine goes down tomorrow. Although I have to say Milo has enjoyed this little blanket so much. I think I'm going to have to get him another one. And by the way, hidey ho for Mr. Milo. All right, we're going to go ahead and talk about today's video. I have eight boxes to open, six subscription boxes, but one of them has three months, I think, worth of boxes. I thought I'd been sharing this particular subscription, but I guess I've missed a few months, so we're going to catch back up on that one. As always, if you like what you see, please consider hitting that subscription button and giving this video a thumbs up. I'd love to have you as part of my Georgia Sunshine family. Now, grab a snack, grab a drink because these multi unboxings take a little bit of time and let's go ahead and dive in my first one is my shabby lane t-shirt subscription now if you're unfamiliar with this subscription it is a monthly t-shirt subscription for $19.99 which falls under that budget friendly price point here on my channel you get a t-shirt as well as a free gift and if after watching this you decide you want to grab it I have a discount code for 20% off. Y'all, I love these t-shirts so much for a variety of different reasons. When I get home from work, I just want comfy clothes on and almost every day I put on a Shabby Lane t-shirt. I loved the, um, I guess it was technically the November t-shirt, but we ha got it in time to wear it all December. It was so cute. They're soft. They wash and wear really great. I will put them under a flannel or a denim shirt or a denim jacket. Um, I will wear them by themselves in the summer. I just really like this budget-friendly subscription box. So this month it came in this little uh, package. I did get snabbed by the post office just a little bit, so I got a little hint of the color. I have to tell you, she does the best colors every single month, and I've never seen her duplicate a color, which is kind of fun. Now, she's usually a little bit ahead with her t-shirts. So in November, we got the Christmas t-shirt, and then for December, which is this box, we probably are getting like a winter-themed t-shirt. So let's check it out. Inside, it's got a little snowman. And it says, uh, let it snow. And this says warm winter wishes here on the tag. And then I think here is our extra little goodie. I don't think you can see it with the cellophane, but let's go ahead and open it and check it out. All right. So there's a little card and you can put this on your fridge or frame it and put it um, in your entryway or on your desk at work. Here's our t-shirt, y'all. Do you see this color? This is a little bit different, but I love these peacock blue colors. They just make my eyes pop. And this one says, cozy season. Oh, <laughs> yes. Isn't that adorable? So put this, I do have a flannel that has this color um, plaid in it. This would be great under that flannel shirt. Oh. <gasps> So cute, right? I'll try this on um, in just a minute over here and you can see how it fits. I technically go up a size in mine. They're, they're size pretty true to size, but I like mine to be a little bit bigger. So I get a large and then let's take a peek at the freebie. It's in here or the extra. It says, friend, we are sending you all the warm wishes this winter season. I hope you stay cozy and warm. Enjoy this month's t-shirt that you that will carry you through the winter months. Sending lots of hope for a new year. All right. Ooh, you guys, this one has earrings that goes with it. Okay, so we have a little pair of earrings. These are right up my alley. I've been needing a new pair of gold earrings when my daughter moved out. She took them all with her. <laughs> which is fine and then we got this cute little necklace isn't that pretty if you're wearing cardigans and things this would be so pretty or long sweaters isn't that gorgeous it does look like you've got some room yeah quite a bit of room to make it top longer or shorter if you want so pretty I love those earrings and then again we've got that t-shirt so cute, right? So if you want to get the Shabby Lane t-shirt subscription, use my discount code for 20% off. Thank you to Shabby Lane for sending this over. All right, so the next box we're going to talk about is the Emoda box. This I showed last month and we all kind of went gaga for it. It is a monthly tea subscription box 
And let me preface by saying that I've opened a lot of tea subscription boxes on this channel, and I don't think any of them are bad. I think there are really good tea subscription boxes out there. But what makes this one stand out and kind of rise to the top is you are fully able to customize all of your tea choices every single month. And why I like that is so many of the others, you fill out a profile and you say, you know, I like this tea or I don't like that tea. And I know what I like. I want a strong black tea. That is who I am. I don't want an herbal tea. I don't want a white tea. I'll do a rooibos or a honeybush tea. I like a chai. Um, but I know what I don't like and I know what I do like. And even though I have a profile with some of those other companies, some things that I don't like will slip in, which feels very wasteful because most of the time I'll try them and I just don't like them and they end up in the trash. Just feels wasteful, you know? So what's cool about this one is they only use small batch crafted teas. There's no artificial sugar, no artificial flavor, and they only use small tea companies to source all of theirs. And so you go in every month and you pick your teas. But what's cool is they actually show you a picture of the tea and you can see the bits of like fruit or nuts or obviously if you have a nut allergy you could not pick those teas but they show you all of the bits and pieces in the tea which is really really great and they change up the tea every single month so if you like white tea there's a whole big selection of white tea whole big selection of green tea whole big selection of black tea, of honeybush or rooibos tea, whatever you like, they're going to have, and you can pick four different flavors. Now, this is $22 a month, and I do have a discount code for 40% off your first box if you're interested. Now, I do have a caveat. This particular box was sent to me for review, and they said they wanted to feature some of their holiday teas, so I did not pick the teas that are in here. You will get to, and I was fine with that because I thought it would be fun to kind of see what holiday teas they had, so we're going to take a look at these. They do give members a 20% discount on their website, so you can go and repurchase if you find a tea that you're in love with. I love that they give you a discount for that and it's a way you're able to try and figure out what teas you like and don't. First of all, it comes in this box. I did take my um, shipping label off, but it looks like a little envelope. Really, really cute in your mailbox. And then you open it like this. It says Christy. You can see it was customized for me. And then here is a little card. And it talks about the different teas for December. It gives you the 20% discount. And then my first tea is called the Grinch. Okay, this has to be a green tea. Wouldn't you think if it's going to be green, it's got to be the Grinch? Okay, so it says this one is a mellow green tea that is layered with cinnamon and citrus notes, including a touch of bergamot. Now, I love, love, love bergamot. So I might like this one. I do like a green tea now and then, and I think with the cinnamon and the citrus and the bergamot in here, that might be a really good one. You can have the little tea bags put into your subscription if you would like, um, and that way you just put about a teaspoon of tea into the bag, and then you seal it up and put it down in your cup. I have tea um, steepers, so I did not need that that are reusable, um, but you can have those put in, and it's free if you want that. Okay, so the Grinch. The second one is called Chocolate Sauce. It says, this is a black tea infused with all natural fudge flavor with a kiss of peppermint and black currant. Okay, this would be a good night tea for me. Now, also, when you're going to look at the teas, it tells you like your caffeine. So if you are if you like a lot of caffeine or you don't want much caffeine, you can pick from those too. It says that this one is a higher caffeine one, but I like peppermint sometimes. It tends to... Um, quench my sweet tooth a little bit and I don't want to eat anything after I've had peppermint. It makes everything taste funny. So this is a good one for the new year for me. Okay, the next one is an eggnog tea. It says that this one is get into the holiday spirit with this deliciously festive blend. Woodsy, creamy, and perfectly spiced with cinnamon and cardamom. This oolong tea, I do like an oolong tea blend, is dairy-free. Top it with froth milk for a fun latte. And these are still on the website. So if you go on and any of these feel like they're teas that you want, you can still get these. And then this one is a buttery shortbread. I love a cookie tea. So this one says, like crumbly shortbread biscuits fresh from the oven, this honeybush tea is a rich and delicately sweet blend. 
Um, you will love the warm vanilla and golden buttery flavors. That sounds really good too. And this one's caffeine free. So if you have a sweet tooth at night, this might be the one to go for. So that was my Emota box. Again, $22. Another one that fits in that um, budget friendly category. I personally consider budget friendly boxes $25 or under. And you can use my discount code to get 40% off your first box. Thank you to Emota for sending that over. Okay, the next box we're going to talk about is a box that hasn't been on the channel for a little while. This is the Wix Wax box. Unfortunately, the owner of this box was in a car accident and it took her a while to kind of get recovered. So she is back up on her feet with her subscription. Now she has two different subscription boxes you can get. I'm going to show you the candle box. Now the candle box is $16.95. What's cool about this one is you get a 16 ounce candle. A lot of candle boxes, we just get an eight ounce candle. This is a big mammer jammer. Or if you are a wax melt person, she has what's called the Centibration. Now she's going to send me that box. Maybe I'll be able to show it next month. But the Centibration box is $19.99. But listen to all you get in this one. If you're a wax melt fan, I just got a new wax warmer. You get three ounces of a tube of wax dots. That sounds interesting. A two ounce clamshell, a one ounce sample clamshell, a box of wax bark, and three bags of fun shaped wax melts. That's a lot of wax for $19.99. Now I do have a discount code to get 50% off your first subscription. So after this, if you wanna grab it, you're able to. I believe that the subscription sent every month is exclusive to the candle, but you do get a 20% discount so you can go on and repurchase if you would like. So this is what the box looks like. And like I said, this one is the candle subscription. I will hopefully be able to share with you this the uh, wax melts in a different video. The little paper in here it says Candle of the Month Club, which is what this one's called. Again, the wax melt subscription is called Centibration. It says, guess what's taking the stage as the star of this month's Candle of the Month. Drum roll, please. It's spiced cranberry. Cranberry, that iconic fruit that struts its stuff throughout the entire holiday season. Even if you're not a fan of cranberry sauce, we won't judge you. It's pretty much the VIP guest at every Thanksgiving and Christmas dinner table in the good old USA. But here's the twist. It's not just about eating it this time. We've captured its unique and wonderful fragrance to give you a whole new way to savor the holiday spirit this time of year. Spice Cranberry is here to jazz up your senses. All right, so let's check it out. Oh, I also forgot to tell you not to go backwards, but I'm going to go backwards for just a minute. The Emota box, if you're in, oh, Canada, you can get this box too. Okay. So when you open the box, you can see our big candle down in here. They even did some cranberry tissue inside, which is very fitting. There's a little piece of tape on the box. I'm just going to rip it. Look at the size. I don't know why my printer's going if you hear it in the background. Look at the size of this candle, y'all. That is a big member jammer. That's a lot of candle. Like, I will burn this in a month, but it'll probably take me the whole month. You pull it off. Oh, yes. This kind of feels wintry. I think this is a good one. This is their December one, but I'm going to burn it, obviously, in January because this is the last day of the month. And it does kind of give you that crisp clean feeling where we're all taking out our Christmas decorations. We're in the mood to clean and organize. This feels like the perfect atmospheric setting. Does that even make sense? You all know what I mean. It smells good. You get a little bit of spice with cinnamon, a little bit of like clean, and then that like bite of cranberry. This is lovely. Lovely. All right. So thank you, Wix Wax Candle, for sending that over. You can use the information down below to get 50% off your first box if you're interested. Y'all, we're cruising on through. The next box we are going to talk about is the one that I have three of. Okay, I, like I said, I thought I had shown this the past couple of months, but I guess I haven't. And <laughs> That is my Annie's Kit Club. Now, if you've not been watching my channel for a while, you may not know my love for Annie's Kit Clubs. But what I think is cool about them is they kind of quench my desire to do a craft because everything you need for the craft 
comes in this kit other than maybe a pencil or a pair of scissors. Um, I get the card making kit, but I've done a ton of them in the past. If you like to paper craft, if you like to knit or crochet, if you like to quilt, they have crafting kits for kids that are really good. I've shown a couple of those over the years. Pretty much anything you like to do, they have a kit for, and most of their kits are $19.99 a month. And I have a discount code to try any of their kits for 50% off your first month, making it only 10 bucks. Super budget friendly. So if you're looking for a way to just have some fun in the new year, maybe to unplug, that's what I try and do, unplug, sit at the dining room table, maybe turn a book on or um, listen to some music and I just kind of forget about all the worries and just do a little bit of crafting. So these are all my card making kits that I guess I haven't done for a couple of months. I, I didn't realize it had been that long, quite honestly. So now I get to have a big like card making Arama Palooza, you know what I mean, night. All right, so the first one that I have is, I guess a black tie Christmas. So this is what it looks like. You get a little book and these are the cards that you're going to make. So we've got those two, we've got these two, and then we've got these two. I love that tree paper, really, really cute. And you get to make multiples, but anything you need from even the little um, pieces of foam tape to elevate a piece to give it a 3D effect, you're gonna get it in this kit. So I'm gonna open one of the kits just to show you. I won't do this with all three because I think it'll get boring, but I'll kind of give you an idea what is in this one. So you get your book, which tells you everything you need. Also, when you order the card making kit, there actually is an extra little $10 value kit you'll get in your first one. It's got a couple of little tools like a folding paper tool, a bone thing that helps you with creases in your cards and things like that. So that will come free. I have some little stamps here with all the little words right here. Um, we have ribbons and sequins in here. I think that's got the little your little tape and all of that in there. Oh no, here's our little foam square dots that make things um, stick out from your card just a little bit. Here is our envelopes. Let's see what's in here and our cards. And I like how it's all individually packed so you don't have to open it until you're ready and that way you can stick it back in here if you're like halfway through card making and have to put it away. So these are our envelopes and you can see, like look at all the cards you get to make from this kit. Our tape our cards, looks like this month's card. I don't know if you can see it, there's where it bends, our black and white. So just two colors this time. And then here is all our pretty paper. I feel like I opened a kit very similar to this. Maybe it was the November kit that was kind of black, white, and gold. These are the papers. And then you also get all of the cutouts you need. These just punch out really easily. They're like perforated. So like you can see how that Christmas tree just pops out. So that was this one. So it'll be fun to kind of maybe do that one in the next maybe week or so, and then I can put it away with my Christmas stuff. All right, I went ahead and opened these because I was just curious. The next one that I got is called Hello Sunshine. Now this one sounds right up my alley. I also opened these because I was like, did I order a different any subscription? I'm telling you, I just didn't feel like it had been that long since I've shown one of these. So this one looks really pretty for spring. This one says, hello, sunshine. Although I know it's just winter, I get it, but you'll be ready for spring. See how that little flower looks like it's 3D. It's got one of those little foam pieces behind it. Um, one says smile, just happy with the yellow and green. So these are the cards we'll do for this kit. This one says thinking of you. Um, one says, you are one of a kind. One says, hello, sunshine. And one says, smile. So that kit is really, really pretty. I'll just give you, I'm not gonna take it apart, but I'll kind of show you the papers of this one. Aren't those pretty? There's all our little cutouts. It's such a fun crafting idea. I've also said, like, if you just wanna have a girlfriend over and maybe you guys have like a little crafting night at the table, maybe serve a little charcuterie board, have girl dinner and craft, that would be really, really fun. Okay, and then the last one that I got, I thought this one was interesting. 
We will get all kinds of kits through the years. You'll get one that's birthday themed, but this one is actually more condolence themed, which you know, is a little hard to think about, but it will be nice to have if you need it. And I really like the colors of this one. I'll pull it out and kind of show you. It's like lavender and green. It's not, I don't know. It's not so colors that feel so sad. Now this one, interestingly enough, has some kind of little tool right here. And look at the ink we're getting in this one. Every kit's a little bit different. This has got some like jewel dots which is really pretty. Look at the different thread you're getting with that one and ribbon. So one of these says heartfelt condolences. One says with deepest sympathy. Um, what else? Um, always in our hearts. That one's really pretty with that paper. What does this one say? Thinking of you. That's where you use the little, those little pretty little dot jewels that they had in there. That's really pretty, isn't it? So I like that every single month you kind of get a different theme. If there's a holiday, we'll get like a holiday theme. If there's not, then they'll give us something like a thinking of you or happy birthday or something like that. And although we don't like to think about sad things, it's nice to just have these pre-made and ready to so go. That was that. I pay for this particular subscription with my own money. I really like it. I just like sitting down and having a craft night every once in a while. I got to catch up though, because I have several months worth to um, check out. So if you want to do an Annie's Kit Club, you can do any of them. You don't have to do the card making kit. You can use my discount code. that's going to give you 50% off. And like I said, the vast majority of them are $19.99. Some of the kids subscriptions, I think actually both of the kids subscriptions give kids two different craft projects for the month. They're done really, really well too. So if you've got a birthday for, you know, like a a tween or like that eight to 13 year old, those craft kits are really, really great. Okay, well, let's keep on going. I just realized that this next box, I didn't cut the tape for. This is my tiered tray decor box. Now they're a little bit ahead of the game too, because their December box is actually going to be to decorate your tiered tray for January. So if you're unfamiliar with the tiered tray, it's just exactly what it sounds like. It's a tray that's on kind of a stand and it's multi-leveled. I have one in my kitchen. I have one in my dining room and I have one in my office and they're just really fun to decorate. I love the one tucked into my kitchen. It's just an area of my kitchen I didn't really have anything with and I kind of like to just mix it up. Right now it's a hot chocolate bar. I just add a couple of really cute mugs, some cute spoons, a jar of marshmallows, a jar of hot chocolate and then I'll put whatever decorations for Christmas I had some little lighted up Christmas houses for winter I'll do some snowflakes or something like that kind of mixed in with it um, but this is a way that you can do it it is $50 so it has all the decor now I say this every month you don't necessarily get everything in this box you're going to need to decorate an entire tier tray that's not really the point. The point is to add new things and then you're able to take what you get every month and pick and choose different pieces are going to go to complete your tiered tray, if that makes sense. Like I got this red lantern a couple of years ago. I love that little red lantern. I pull it out for my Christmas tiered tray. I pull it out for my Valentine's Day tiered tray. I pull it out for my 4th of July tiered tray because it kind of works. So you're gonna get pieces that you can mix and match all year long, but every month is a little bit of a theme. And I do have a discount code for 10% off with this guy. So let's see what she has for January. I'm assuming it's gonna be some kind of winter theme. Theme. And right off the bat, I see a little sleigh. So adorable. Now, again, this you could put a Christmas tree on top of and make it um, a Christmas tier tray. So I basically have little shoe boxes. I have a closet in my garage and I have shoe boxes and I label everything for my tier tray. I think there's five of them and they're just like little shoe boxes that I get the plastic ones at the Dollar Tree. And I'll put like Christmas, winter, or Valentine's Day, 4th of July, or I'll kind of tell what's in each one. But a lot of times I just open each and see what's inside when I'm going to decorate one. Um, this one says warm up by the fire. That's adorable. I love something that goes over the top of a tiered tray. It just adds a little texture and interest. All right, we have a snowflake, which you can hang this from your tiered tray, or you can just put this down and let it sit like that. 
Very, very cute. Again, I feel like you could use that for a Christmas one too. Here's a little sprig. We always get some kind of greenery or floral, which I have this little pitcher. I think it might've come from the Tear Trade Decor Box. It's like the perfect size. And I just change out the little bit of greenery or floral that I have. It's just the right touch for the very top of my tear tray. Any kind of floral or greenery kind of softens it up and fills it out a little bit more. But you can also just tuck this you know, in between your decor to fill up a space, which is nice. All right, we have a little snowman, and this one says, let it snow. And if you didn't want to use this on your tiered tray, look, you could use it as an ornament. I love the blue. It's kind of not a true baby blue. It's got a little bit of teal in there. Oh, I like this one. This one's bigger. Ooh, it looks like there's a twofer in this one. This one says, there's no place like home. And this one says, burr. <laughs> That's perfect for a winter tray, isn't it? And what, what I love about this is I'll probably take some kind of blue coffee mugs. I'll keep my hot chocolate bar there and I'll just mix in some of these little accents to it so I can still keep that hot chocolate bar out. Um, so when we're watching a movie or something, we can run down and get what we want. And then there's a little toboggan. Isn't that sweet? I love it. So, so pretty. So again, a lot of these you can mix and match throughout the year and use them whenever you want. So if you want to check out the tiered tray decor box, you can use my discount code for 10% off. Now I've shoved all my tiered tray decor on top of our last box. So let me pull that off. I can't wait to decorate with that. I love it. Okay, the last box that we're going to talk about is my bath bevy box now if you did not watch my last video it was another multi unboxing and i did the first bath bevy box so bath bevy has two different subscription boxes and these are bath and shower subscription boxes so i went ahead and did the bath box in my previous unboxing if you want to go see that i will put the video down below there was some six really good boxes in there. And then um, they have a tubless box. Now their tubless box is for anybody that doesn't want to take a bath. You don't like a bath. You don't have a bathtub. You have trouble getting in and out of the bath. The shower box is going to be for you. Now, if you didn't see that last video and are interested in the tub box, they have more like bubble bars, Epsom salt soaks, bath bombs. Um, we'll get some like sugar scrubs, sometimes a candle, anything that has to do with the bath. But this one, no tub required. They are $43 and 32 cents. It's a weird amount of money on this one. And I do have a discount code for 20% off. So the shower box is going to have like shower steamers, body wash, um, sugar scrubs, all kinds of things like that. And although they're going to have similar scents, you're not going to get the same thing in each box. There's different scent profiles. Now, if you're like, I'm not really sure if I want to subscribe to the box and commit, you can go over to Bath Bevy. My discount code doesn't work on their website, but they have individual pieces that you can get. And I always say, just be careful because you're going to be hooked. Like, I don't want Bath and Body Works. I don't want any of the other stuff anymore. This is my love. This is my jam. All right. So you can tell it's a tubless box because it says tubless here. And when you open it up, it has a winter theme. Now the cards are going to be the same. This card was the same one for the tub box, but the items in the box are going to be a little bit different. It says bath bevy, and this is more of a winter themed box. So the first thing we got in here is called tree farm. And these are our shower steamers. And I have to tell you, if you have not tried the bath bevy shower steamers in the last like four or five months, they have pumped up the jam pump it up <laughs> remember that song anyway they have pumped up the scent like they have like tripled the scent of these there is no mistaking them anymore some people would be like mm, i don't think the scent is strong enough they are strong now you put these in your shower um right outside where the tub or where your shower kind of sprinkles so the water just barely gets on them it's not like dousing them and as the heat comes and the water comes, they start to bubble up and they emit this great aromatherapy scent. These are amazing. Christmas tree scent, interesting. Okay, so we've got that. I also like them if you have a cold, a lot of times they'll do a eucalyptus one or something. Really, really great, kind of helps to loosen up whatever's in your 
chest. All right, the next thing we have is an orange cranberry soy candle tea light set. And these look like they have some little, maybe some orange peel. Let's look on the top of them. So, so pretty. So you can light up if you're cleaning or something. These would smell really fresh. But if you want to take a shower and light a little candle, you're able to do that too. Ooh, pretty. Oh, these smell good. They are making my mouth water. This smells like fresh orange and cinnamon. Oh, that smells good. Okay, so we got a little set of four of those. Also, a lot of times in the winter, we might lose power because of the, the weather. You've got those. They always add a little, if they do a candle, a little set of Bath Baby matches. I love that touch. All right, the next thing we have is their car caramelized pear whipped soap scrub. And their whipped soap scrub is real, real thick. It's like a putty. I'm not going to stick my finger in this one because I did it in the last video. But what I love about this one is when you go to scoop it up, a lot of times other sugar scrubs will just like run through your fingers. And by the time you get it on your body, you've lost half of it in the shower. This one's like a putty. So when you pull it out, it's real easy to work with. You just rub it over your body. It's got the perfect amount of scrub, not too little, not too much. And it's also soap. So you get the scrub and the soap at the same time. So it's like two steps in one. The caramelized pear does not smell like pear to me at all. It smells a little bit like cake frosting, but not quite as sweet, but lovely. So we got that. I think I got the same one in my bath box. Not, not sad about that. We got a candy cane handmade soap. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Hold on. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at that soap. I love a handmade soap. Oh my goodness, that's lovely. This is a good like morning, wake you up, bright scent. All right, then we have a creme brulee body wash. Their body wash is really nice too. It smells good. Let's smell this one. I don't remember if I got anything creme brulee in the bath box. Let's see. It's kind of milky. Well, I mean, I guess creme brulee would be milky. <laughs> What does it say the notes are? Hmm, it doesn't say. Let's see. Um, the body wash. Delight your senses with the scent of classic rich creamy dessert with a caramelized sugar topping while cleansing and moisturizing your skin. Nice. Okay. And then last but not least, this is another thing they do really, really well is their lotions. And they come in a pump. This is their peppermint twist lotion. This is a vanilla and peppermint. And I have to say, I really like the size of this because it takes about a month to get through this and then you're ready for your next month. That's what I also like about these is I feel like you can finish everything in about a month and then, like I said, you're ready to go. This one's got a little piece right here that you just pull out when you're ready to use it and then you start your pump. It's lotion. I was thinking it was soap for a minute. Ooh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. It's kind of a really vanilla-y. You know those peppermints you, you get that are the soft, buttery ones and you put in your mouth and they immediately start to dissolve? They're like that light peppermint with some vanilla in it. Lovely. You're not, you're not feeling like you're a big candy cane walking around. I think because of the peppermint too, it's got this cooling effect on your skin. This is going to make your skin feel good when you get out of the shower. Your skin just feels tingly. That's nice. Okay, so that was that box. You know what? I have one more box. I'm trying to get through my box of boxes and I'm gonna grab it because I thought I had it in this haul and I must not brought it over. So you're gonna get a bonus box. Hang on. All right, like I said, I'm trying to get to the bottom of my stack of boxes for the new year. And I realized that I never opened my November book of the month. Now, if you wanted to see what I got in my December book of the month, you can go over and watch my last video. But I'm just going to open this one because I'm dying to see what is inside. If you're unfamiliar with book of the month, it's again another really budget friendly subscription box. It is $16.99. I pay for this one with my own money every single month. What I love about book of the month is you can pick a hardback book. It's a new release. Sometimes the releases, a bunch of people were saying in the my December unboxing that the book I got was not even on Amazon yet. It was an early release. Um, so you can get early releases or new releases in so many different genres. So if you want 
like historical fiction. I think that might be what I picked for January. I can't remember now. If you want chiclet, if you just want contemporary fiction, if you want a mystery or creepy, they have something for everybody. And you go in and you pick your book and then they send it. Now, if you have trouble, which I have a lot of trouble some months picking just one, you're actually able to get a discounted rate and pick another one, two, or three, however many books you want, and put them in your box. I was telling people in the December box that I actually have been getting this box for a year, which leveled me up. I guess they have like membership levels. And so um, they sent me like a tote bag and some socks. And um, I think I get a bigger discount if I buy stuff in the store. I get a special like hotline number if I have any trouble or need to get a hold of them, which I never have. But that's kind of cool that they reward you for being like a longtime subscriber. But anyway, if you want to try book of the month, they have a discount code right now. It may expire today or tomorrow. I'm not sure. Um, this is actually how I signed up last November. They have a $5 deal. And so I'm going to put that in the discount, um, in the description box below. And if you can't find the description box, I haven't said this in videos in a long time, just go all the way up to the very top comment under this video and all the information will be there. So let's see what I picked for November. I have been reading like crazy lately if you want a quick a couple of quick um books to read i just finished rock paper scissors by alice feedy go get that book go get that book it is so good um i just finished and this is an older book it's been around for a little while i don't know how i missed it but i just finished the housemaid i couldn't i couldn't stop reading it. I could not put it down. I could not put it down. So those two I highly recommend. Okay. Ooh, I don't remember this one. I mean, I picked it, but I guess it was November, which you did at the end of October. So this one's called The Helsinki Affair. Oh, let's see what this is about. It says in the case, it's the case of Amanda's lifetime, but solving it may require her to betray another spy. Oh, I do remember this one who just happens to be her father. Spying is the family business. Amanda Cole is a brilliant young CIA officer following in the footsteps of her father, who has a, has been a spy since the Cold War. It takes grit and success in this male-dominated world, but one hot summer day, a Russian defector walks into her post. Amanda is given the ultimate chance to prove herself. The defector warns of the imminent assassination of a U.S. senator, um, through a man, though Amanda takes the warning seriously, her supervisors don't. Twenty-four hours later, the senator is dead, and the assassination is just the beginning. Now, I haven't read anything like this. I've been really into mysteries lately, like murder mysteries. This sounds like more of like a spy thriller. I think I'm gonna like this. I think this is gonna be a good like winter cold curl up on the bed and read type of book. So anyway, if you want to check out book of the month, $5. And like I said, you can pick a regular book or you can pick an audio book. The audio book you have in order to get that, you have to download the app to get it. You can't use the regular website, um, but you have to do it the app. And then there's like a little tab down below that you can pick, which is really great. Um, I've got a couple of credits. So I think um, I've decided that I'm gonna be getting some of the audio books. I've been loving audio books lately and I listen to them going back. I, I drive, a round trip about an hour to work every day, 30 minutes there to 30 minutes back. So I'm just going to put an audio book in and just go to town. Um, so anyway, that was all my books. That was all my boxes. <laughs> there was a lot of them. There's a lot of discount codes, 50% off Wix Wax, 50% off Annie's, $5 on the um, Helsinki Affair, 40% off Amoda. I mean, good discount code. So anyway, I will leave them all below. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Happy New Year, and I'll see you soon for another video, guys. Bye-bye.